So that looks radioactive. <laughs> yep. That's the girl from the record store. Alex, right? I'm Steph. Hey. Just seeing if you need food or anything. Oh no, I'm good. Thanks though. Sorry I couldn't hang out at the record store. I've got some time now though if you want to chat. Um Is that record store inventory? <laughs> no. It's character stats. Do you know what a LARP is? Remind me. I've heard the term before. Live action role play. It's like a tabletop role playing game, but acted out in real life. Oh. Costumes, foam weapons, beanbag spells. It's great. Gabe was talking about a LARP with Ethan. Yeah, it's next week. They're coming with me. It's their first time. I'm so excited. <laughs> Would you ever want to join us sometime? Sure, I'd try it. If you and Gabe both like it, it must be super fun. Awesome. Um. So are you um here with somebody or? That's Ryan's stuff. Apparently he ditched me for Gabe. <laughs> they went to get first aid. <laughs> Being a hero again. Ryan's always doing that. <laughs> It's a Lucan family thing. Have you heard about Jed's rescue? It was a big deal. Back when he was a minor, he said- I can't imagine. Alex wants an earload of Haven trivia just now. I'm sorry, Jed. He doesn't like to brag, but there's stuff about it all over the place if you look. Interesting. Interesting. Is that your shot? What is that? This is bedazzled kiwi schnapps. No one's ever ordered it, so Gabe's trying to get rid of it with the jukebox game. <laughs> What's a jukebox game? It's like a short version of 20 questions where you're trying to guess a song, guess wrong, you have to take the shot. <laughs> Ryan and I are going to play. Does the band name have a symbol in it? Like something that's not just a letter? Oh. Yeah, it totally does. Nice. Is the band name only one word? It is more than one word. Hmm. Okay. You've got two questions left. The symbol.
Why do you like this song? So, I guess we're breaking the yes or no questions only rule? Can you handle it? So, why do I like this song? The lyrics crack me up. Even the title's pretty goofy. Reminds me of fun times, I guess. Goofy title, you say? Hmm. Last question. Yeah, all right, I know. And I'm going to... So, does the song title have a curse word in it? <laughs> a curse word? Would that offend you? Answer the question. <laughs> no curse words in the title, ma'am. That's your five. Ready to guess? Yeah. Let me look through one last time. Here's what I know. The band name doesn't have a person's name in it. The band name does. No, the band name doesn't have a person's name in it. The band name does have a symbol in it. It's not a one-word band name. No curse words in the song title. The title's kind of goofy. The title's kind of goofy. But it's not the person name. Guess. Here's what I know. Wait. The band name doesn't have a person's name in uh -huh. it. The band name does have a symbol in it. Does have a symbol. It's not a one-word band name. No curse words in the song title. The title's kind of goofy. It's, it's like a symbol in it. Drinking? Yes. <laughs> Good luck. Should get back to work. Okay. New money. I got ridden up for leaving my phone on. It wasn't even on me. But I guess it started vibrating in my locker when I was on duty. Oh. Yeah, there's sticklers about that stuff. So I should clean this thing up. Say uh, something to Mac. Wow, I messed Mac up pretty good. 
just want to say I'm sorry like that. Holy shit. Can I talk to you real quick? What do you want? Listen, what happened upstairs was fucked up, right? From both of us. Where are you going with this? But Riley's headed over here. She's pretty heated at it. I don't think it helps to recap all the gory details, you know? <laughs> so you're saying you want me to lie to cover your ass? No. No, just like, let me handle it. Look, she's gonna break up with me otherwise. <laughs> We've been together four years. She is the best thing that's ever happened to me. So please, help me out. I, I don't know, man. Shit. Mm. What the fuck is wrong with you? Oh my god, look at your face. No, it's okay. Don't even. What were you thinking? Where's Gabe? Why do you give a shit? Because my boyfriend just got into a fight with him. <sighs> I swear. This is it. You better have a good explanation or... We're done. It's, it's not my fault. I just wanted to talk to the guy. About what? About you! About... why you guys are meeting behind my back. Okay. So, how did the fight happen? The bastard sucker punched me! Oh no! Oh no, he didn't. Okay, um... Not exactly sucker punched, but... He definitely started it. Nope. Oh, God. Were you there, too? I don't know. Ah, uh, this is so hard. This is toxic relationship for her and him. It's like, he jealous too much. You feel insecure. Gabe already have a wife or a future wife with with Charlotte. And you already have Riley. What do you afraid of about? I don't know, I just I just don't want but he's lying about my brothers. Ish uh, This is so hard. Can I just silent stay silent? <laughs> uh, I don't know. So hard. Ah, uh, avoid further trouble. Avoid further trouble. Okay. Yeah, I was there, but um, I need to get back to work. Sure. Alex, we'll, uh, we'll get out of your way. I can't believe you two. It sounds so childish. I know. I'm sorry. I just get so worked up thinking of you with him. Alex Chen? Uh... So, you were there when your brother assaulted Mac Loudon? I'm Jason Pike, deputy sheriff. I'm gonna have to take you and your brother in for questioning. Oh my god. Mac assaulted Gabe. He's the one you want. <laughs> your face. 
<laughs> you should see your face. Oh, jeez. <laughs> no, I'm only kidding. Uh, nobody's in trouble here. I, <laughs> Gabe and I just like to prank each other. <laughs> I've never been pranked by a cop before. <laughs> you definitely got me. <laughs> Thanks for being a good sport. Can I buy you a drink? Um, maybe. I'm working right now. Well, I'll be at the bar. You want one, you just come by. Have your job. How's your jaw? <laughs> Same. Is the pain bad? Look, Gabe, I'm really sorry. Do you have a cooler under there? I like to hide beers around the house. Because, well, you never know. You never know what? You just never know. So, need a manager for your underground cage fighting career? Gabe, I'm really sorry. How many bones have you broken? Like, on other people? Dude, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to hurt you. Don't apologize. I'm fine. Now that we're talking about it... I guess I never realized. That I can kick your ass? Yeah, I guess. You know, I never realized what your life must have been like. 
on your own. It was fine. You know, when I pulled you off the Mac and you hit me, I, I was angry. Then I thought about how you took him apart. Like you've done it before. Didn't you go to juvie? Isn't that like prison? Yeah. That was the hardest time of my life. Some days I... I didn't think I'd make it out. But I get the feeling you've been through worse. I can tell there's something going on with you. Something troubling you. Maybe it's time you open up. I want to talk to Gabe, but what can I even say right now to explain what happened with Mac? Growing up in the system was hell. In my first foster home, an older boy followed me into the bathroom. So I pushed him out. He got angry. So did I. Then I broke his nose. I was 14. In the second home, one of the other kids committed suicide. And I couldn't eat for a month. Okay. After a couple of weeks in the fifth home, I got so depressed that my new parents sent me to a hospital. I never saw him again. The hurt follows me everywhere. It's the other kids get adopted, leave the system. Not me. They never picked me. I'm broken. Do you really believe that? Wouldn't you? After all this time, it's hard not to take it personally. And it just keeps happening. It never stops. Then I look at you. You've got a home, a job, a girlfriend. You've got it all figured out. And I don't. Is that for me? <laughs> it is now. What is this? A reminder. Looks like a match to me. That was the last matchbook I got when I was still in juvie. Did some pretty unsavory stuff to score it. And you still have it? Yeah. I carry it with me everywhere. When I got out, I went through the last few matches real quick, obviously, but I, I could never bring myself to use the last one. It reminded me how bad life got and how much better I was gonna make it.
Babe, I can't accept this if it means so much to you. No, no, that's exactly why I want you to keep it. When I found Haven and Charlotte, I couldn't believe they were real. Everything before was such hell. Now it's different. You can do the same. Start a new life. You made it out of the system, Alex. You survived. It's time to move on. No, you don't understand. It's not that simple. It's not that simple. I've made so many mistakes. We all have. Survival isn't a neat and tidy process. But it's way better than the alternative. And don't forget, I'm here to help you. That's not gonna change. Change soon, you know. So, when were you gonna tell me about the guitar? <laughs> oh, shit. You found it. It was supposed to be a huge surprise. <laughs> surprise? <laughs> well, what do you think? I love it. Thank you so much. Of course. Welcome home. Oh, hey, dude, what's up? Hey, is Ethan up here? No, he was heading home. He was, but I haven't seen him in a while. I told him not to wander off. I'll find him. Gabe, wait. Earlier, when I was talking with Ethan, he told me he was hiking up the mountains to explore the old mine. What? Why didn't you say something? I'm sorry. If he actually went up there, we need to move now. Okay, let's go. I'm sorry. Just want to break little trust from the little guy. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I just don't want the people to hate me. I'm sorry. Ethan? Ethan! Come on, pick up, pick up. Alex. This way. Wow. Been a while since I was up here. Why didn't you come here? How are you? No. You don't do your ranger stuff around here? Private land. Outside of my jurisdiction. Dad brought me up here a bunch when I was little, though. I was his miner in training. <laughs> that was back before mining meant blowing the tops off mountains. Any luck? In touch base with the safety team up at the site. We're gonna postpone tonight's blast until we find them. Oh. At least we're not racing the clock. 
Hey. You good? Charlotte's gotta be losing it right now. Hey, she's tough. Always has been. Come on, let's take a look around. This kid. Can you imagine the shit we would have caught from Dad if we'd done anything like this? I should have said something earlier. I didn't. I mean, when he said he was going to the old mine... Alex, I... it's fine. You couldn't have known. It's not your fault. Yeah. Still, though. I'm gonna go take a look around. Let me know if you spot any sign of Ethan. Sure. I can do that. How was Ethan planning to get into the mine? Mm -hmm. Landed a job on my first day. Maybe this fresh start is still salvageable. Oh, uh, thank you. Can I text? <laughs> okay. 